Hello, Cancer. It's my lady from Lady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of 10-16 through the 22nd, 2017. The cards I'm using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for a like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings. If you'd like a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me. We can set something up. Other than that, let's get this show on the road. What's going on for the Cancer? Cancer, Cancer, Cancer. October 16th through the 22nd, 2017. 16th through the 22nd, 2017. Cancer. Cancer. All right, so whatever this situation is, maybe it's a mental thing. It could be an actual physical person, but somebody is um, the on and off relationship. They waiting for a love to come back in or just the feeling of being loved. All right, so it seems like somebody may be dealing with somebody they work with or this person just... Um, Maybe like a certain their power over you, basically. Yeah. So it seems like somebody may be dealing with their ex in this situation. It makes me feel like you dealing with your ex. Maybe you want your ex to come back, you know. But I'm not feeling any current relationship. But I'm feeling like somebody want their ex to come back. But it seemed like you guys might have broke up or stopped talking to each other or something. Maybe over a power struggle. It seems like. I mean, I guess emotionally wise, you lost because you want this person to come back. Okay. Cancer, cancer, cancer. All right. So there's also some secrets going on here. All right, what are the secrets? What are the secrets for the Cancer? Cancer Cancer love reading, October 16th through the 22nd, 2017. Yeah. All right, so if this hasn't happened for you guys, it's going to happen pretty quick. So let's see what this secret is. Okay, so it seems like somebody's going to want you to sacrifice something. So this could be your ex that you're thinking about that you're still in love with. They probably want you to sacrifice your current relationship. Or maybe it got something to do with this um, power fight y'all got going on. Somebody wants you to get rid of something and you not, you're not ready to. You don't want to. So I feel like that might be one of the reasons they left, you know. But it seems like they're going to give you an ultimatum pretty soon. All right. So, this person feels like you chopped them down a size and they chop you down a size as well. I mean, that, basically, you guys run around humbling each other with this uh, power struggle. But it seems like this person, either you about to get them to get rid of something or... um. They're about to get you to get rid of something. And something you really don't want to do. Okay, yeah, so it seems like they might be trying to get you to get rid of something. And they've been telling you this over and over and over. And it's like you're not listening. And it could be an a ex that they want you to get rid of. Or it could be it could be anything. It could be anything. It's not saying, but maybe the Cleo cards will tell us. All right, so. Wow. Okay, for some of you, it's like somebody moving in together. Somebody wants you guys to move in together, but somebody don't feel like they're ready for that. Or actually just get back together. You know, I feel like somebody got commitment issues. All right. All right, what's going on with the cancer, cancer, cancer? Oh, somebody is stalking. Somebody is stalking somebody that they love. All right, what's going on with the cancer, cancer, cancer? Love reading, October 16th through the 22nd, 2017. Cancer, 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 love reading. Okay, I read these straight out the book, guys. 
yeah this is definitely dealing with an ex so somebody wants you to get rid of your ex or your ex wants you to get rid of something or so jesus oh, so for some of you your ex wants you to get away from get rid of a baby or a new relationship okay yes this is definitely getting ready to happen for you guys within the next couple of days okay if it's usually when i see these in personal readings this and this it happens sometimes that night or within the next two days but it definitely seems like an ex is about to come back trying to get you to move out your new person or move in with them or something like that all right read these straight out the book first we have the knight of coins and it says a person of trust who will guide and help you is approaching approach any situation with great planning and organization so this makes me feel like if you are gonna leave your partner make sure you plan this don't just jump thinking that, that everything is gonna be great you know you got to know what you're getting yourself into all right so we have the nine of cups reversed and this says honest communication nine of cups okay honest communication trustworthy bonds and freedom indulgence uh feels good for a short while so this makes me feel like once you do take that leap it's gonna be okay for a little bit and then reality is gonna hit like what did what i what did i do okay all right so we got the empress card and this is um at times you may doubt yourself or circumstances however new and exciting times are approaching a time of love sensuality uh pregnancy may be indicated so it seems like like up here you really care for this person that you're leaving for but i don't know if you leave somebody for somebody else they always gonna have that in the back of their heart that you're gonna leave them for somebody else too but I don't know. Maybe you guys are different. All right. So we got the six of coins. No, sorry. Six of cups reversed. Six of cups reversed. It says the future events that have ha not happened yet but are near fruitation. So basically, if anything hasn't happened here, for some of you, it's getting ready to happen within the next week or couple of days. But... That's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a personal read, check in the description box below. Email me, and we can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful week.